What's up, everybody? Welcome to another haunted exploring video with your boy Trash Skipper Heel. I am at a new location where I spoke to I spoke to my mom and stepdad, and they said they were, said there's some hauntings back here. So I'm gonna go take a look at, at it and see where it is. And before I get to go in here, um, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, push the notification bell, and don't forget to smash that like button. Before doing anything else. Check out my Facebook page. Instagram. And my Twitter. We are going to do a spill box and everything else, but I got a fireplace, so... I had the final place, don't know where it's at, but I'm gonna go do it. And I, this is my welcome back video, why my new town I moved to, my, in new locations. So, without any further ado, before we do anything, if you guys see anything or hear anything that I cannot, please leave your comments below, and if you guys have earplugs, put them in to see if you guys hear anything. Let's do this. Okay. Yeah, make sure there's no way back here. I do have a flashlight, just in case it gets dark. That's a corn thing right there. Yeah, the reason why I'm all dressed up is it's just freaking cold as hell right now. I do not have my gun with me at all. I do not. I only have a flashlight with me. So we're gonna check this area out. If not, then we're gonna head back the other way. Okay, that's our cornfields. So let's head back the other way. On the way here, I did see, I did spot three raccoons and everything. I am not Joe Defense because that is farm land. Don't think they can get a minute ago. I heard a gunshot. And all right here, there's no trash hats and signs, so I can come back. Not a fucking gunshot. That's four gunshots I have heard. I just see a full, I just see a raccoon turn in one between here. You don't want to piss him off. Apparently the place I'm going to, it's a warehouse. Apparently the guy that worked there lived, lived downstairs and had an office upstairs and he hung himself. And it's haunted in a whole well when people used to work at the warehouse. It, it. Wait, guys, what that? Anyways, the guy that worked here a long time ago lived in a warehouse. He had a bomb hat that he lived at in the top he worked at. And one day he hung himself. And people said enough with the fact that he used to work at, a lot of activity happened. And we're trying to find out how to get in there without getting caught. That's a bad thing. I gotta make sure there's no fucking cameras. Cause those cameras are screwed. Not a damn gun. 
Ciao. You know, came so far. It's not a freaking bar while. I don't know, this is it or what? Okay, that's empty. So, yeah, that has to be it. The whole area is empty. I can make a quick phone call real quick. I can make a phone call so I'll hold on for a minute. Hey, I I found an office that's go that's completely empty and there's nobody there. How the fuck did I get in to see it? Because I because it's it the the office I'm at right now it's empty. There's nothing inside of it. Son of a bitch. Uh, I haven't took, I haven't used that yet. I just can't see. I just can't because I'm at the warehouse right now. I don't, and I was kind of let you know that I found it and the and uh, the whole thing's empty. Well, that's stupid. Well, if I well before I come back, uh, I'll probably do it. Uh, Spill box and whatever. We'll see if I get any, anything on that. Cause, it, cause it looks pretty. Cause when I looked inside and through the, looks out, I can't get the, go by the gate. When I looked inside it, it looked pretty fucking creepy. All right. All right. Well, let's talk to my mom because they used to work here and. The guy that owned this place, or whatever, had, w w lived in the basement, or the top, and one day he hung himself, so in the comfort room, so this whole area is haunted, but they keep the doors locked. But before I go, I'm gonna do a little thing real quick. So we're gonna do that real quick. I don't know my phone right now. I'm trying to... Shit. 
do this real box. Is there anybody here with me right now? What the f- Is there anybody here? How did you die in that warehouse? Wow. What is your name? Are you in that warehouse right now? How did you die? How did you die? Are you friendly? What the fuck was that? Are you friendly? How old are you? Are you the owner that's talking to me? Hold on. Hold on. I'm doing the e uh, spoo box with this learning. I heard no. Are you the owner that passed away in a warehouse? Holy shit, said yes. So, are you the owner of the warehouse? Are you going to harm me? Am, am I in danger? Let's do that. Let's do a night vision real quick. Tired of talking to good oh, girls. Oh, shut up! Damn it! Talk to bad girls. You know what they really want. Let's see, there's anybody inside of that? Before I get out of here, because the wind just picked up. Sorry that. If you guys spot anything, let me know. If there's anybody if there's any spirit inside that building, please make yourself known right now. Are you here with me right now? Doing that. Well, that spill box was incredible. I got a lot of readings. That's for dang sure. Well, I want to get out of here because. Pretty soon, I want to go to another location that is extremely haunted. It's a north. It used to be a hospital. I think a hospital, or whatever. But it it's a north, and I got told that spirits are evil at that place. So later tonight, I am going there. So don't forget to check that out. Of course, I want to get out of here. Near thing. I do have a flashlight. So before I go. Don't forget to smash, don't forget to subscribe to that channel, push the notification bell, don't forget to smash the like button, and until later, I'll see you in the next one.